What's going on everybody? Cody from View Golf. Today we're going to take a look at what's in my golf bag for 2016. All right, so we'll get things started with the big dog. You got to start with the big boy, right? The driver, I have the Cobra King F6 Plus. This is Cobra's newest driver. Um, I have it set in the towering setting as opposed to the penetrating setting. You got to love the way Cobra <laughs> slaps there. Um, really just awesome touch on on their clubs unlike anybody else really um, I have it set to ten and a half draw that's what works best for me um, just get the ball basically flying as high as possible with my driver um, and I have this in the uh, 65 gram black tie Ozic shaft um, optional from Cobra so so that's the driver uh, we'll get into the three wood now also Cobra King line this is the F6 uh, three wood three and four wood as they as they call it I have I have the my loft or the my fly loft set to 14 and a half um, I have the weight as you can see all the way in the back set to the uh, towering setting as opposed to the penetrating um, also that that um, that weight there is just it's not even a weight it's just a piece of plastic so this is where all the all the weight is here it's it's in its most forgiving setting back here so this is just a piece of plastic just to cover up from dust getting in the head so um, also in the shaft I have a 75 gram black tie stiff shaft um, from Ozic optional from Cobra and the nice blue uh, lamp can grip. So for hybrids, I decided to do a, do it a little bit different this year. Years past, what I've done is uh, go the highest possible iron setting. So I would I would try what that means. What I'm trying to say by that is I try to get you know the three iron if it's available, four iron. I don't I I used to like hitting long irons. Um, you know I'm just gonna try something different. I'm gonna try to you know. Put a put a couple hybrids in the bag and and see if I can you know hit a few more greens from 200 and 200 and so out. So anyway, here's the uh, here's a three hybrid from Cobra. This is the uh, this is the King F6, the two three hybrid. So I have this one set at 17 and a half degrees, and uh, you can see that weight. Nothing to interchange it with. Um, so it's just it's just kind of there. But uh, it's a really good hybrid. I hit the ball. It's a, it's a really nice ball flight, nice and high, which is what I prefer. Uh, it goes a long ways, too. I have this in the 95-gram black tie from Ozic. Again, uh, an option from Cobra with a nice blue Lampkin grips. All right, so this is the big change for me now. So instead of a 4 or a 3 iron, Sometimes even I had a uh, I had a set of TaylorMade TPMB smokes a couple years ago. I even had a two iron. Yeah, so this is this is a little bit of a change for me. So this is going to be my uh, three and four hybrid. Uh, this is the big change. So I have a set at twenty and a half degrees. Um, so this is going to be replacing obviously my four iron most likely. And uh, I like the look of these a lot. They uh, pretty similar to the three. Obviously that weight. Doesn't do much, it's just there. A little more uh, place towards the back for nice high uh, launch and uh, maximum moment of inertia. Nice forgiving hybrid, I like it a lot. And in this one here, we have the 95 gram stiff black tie from Ozic, optional from Cobra. And we have the blue Lampkin grips. Every club's gonna have that blue Lampkin grip. So, my iron sets, start off with I have five through pitching wedge this year so for irons I have the King forged tech irons from Cobra and this is just a super good looking club and you can see the kind of um, the detail behind the Cobra kind of a carbon fiber and it just along the line just looks amazing and then you have the nice um, chrome finish on them and these are super long irons they are really really long and they feel great the nice wide sole allows for the higher launch 
and also just massive amounts of uh, controllability. The top line's not too thick, which is really appealing at, uh, at setup. So I'm, I'm a big fan of these irons. So this is, like I said, five through pitching wedge on those. So now we'll get into the wedges. Since Cobra has not released their wedges yet, what I've been kind of toying around with here lately is the new Callaway Mac Daddy 3. So I have this one in a 56 degree uh, with, a 10, with 10 degrees of bounce, okay? These spin off the planet. I mean, you, they have, if you can see here, they have these little tiny uh, micro grooves in them, which just grips the ball that much more. And I mean, you can really nip the ball and stop it on a dime. So I have that in a 56 degree and also a 60 with, uh, with nine degrees of bounce. So, so that's, my, that's my clubs and then a putter. Going a little, just a little bit old school. Not, not a dinosaur quite yet. I have the TaylorMade Ghost Manta. Now this is actually a converted belly putter. Um, I had to make the change for the new USGA rules. Um, I putted really well when it was a belly putter. Cut it down last year and I, I actually like it. Still, uh, still putt pretty well with it. Have the nice black and red super stroke. Represent the black and red. All right, so that's that's pretty much what I'm playing with this year. Uh, you know, if you have any uh, comments or suggestions for future videos, make sure you leave them in the uh, comments below. Like the video, make sure you subscribe to our YouTube channel, View Golf. Uh, we're gonna have new videos up all throughout the uh, playing season. So hope you guys enjoyed it. Have a good one.